And welcome to another episode of Kentucky Brew Review. I'm Steel Reserve. Special K. And I'm Radar. And today we have Hudpool Festival Bach. It doesn't say how much alcohol is in it, so that will be in the description. This is not a twist off. Here you go, I'm going to steal this. I'm going to use my name here. It is not. Um, I've expected to be a twist off. I, I thought so too. Um, ooh, ooh, it's, it's trying to escape. That's the one I dropped yeah. on the floor. Yeah. Oh, that's Whoa, not very nice. look at that. Whoa. Wait a minute, yeah. wasn't this $250? $299. for a six pack. That is cool. I love beers that are $299 for a six pack. I, that makes I'm me a happy. big fan. Not gonna lie. Ooh. At that point, I'm not even gonna bother getting in singles because it's just. You might not as well a, get the six pack. not even a good it's reason. $299. Yeah. Um, oh, look at that. It's a little roasty up front. It's got a nice head. I, got, I have a nice head on mine. It's going away pretty fast. It's creamy, uh, creamy colored head. It smells really taffy y. It does smell like caramel and taffy. Yes. Slightly like It smells feet. almost like candy. Uh, feet. <laughs> slightly. <laughs> it does smell like candy though. I mean I, I get I get the weird sort of uh, sort of funky Tom, flavor maybe. you're talking about, I think. I uh, color, I it's feet. <laughs> it's pretty color. Um, it's tea color. Like yeah, black tea. Uh, I never, I never expected to uh, to uh, open up a fifty cent beer and and end up with this. Pretty carbonated. All right. It tastes like candy. It does. It tastes it's good. It, it tastes like um, it tastes like taffy. It's good. Caramel taffy. That's actually like. If I just drank this, I'd be like, okay, this is a this is some sort of malt beverage, one of those flavored alcoholic sodas. Um, I don't think I'd call this. I would not be able to call this a Bach. It's not like a Bach. Just just right off the top it's of my head. Festival Bach. It's ah. sweet like a Bach. Very it's malty. Very sweet like a Bach. Yeah. Little roasty. It does. It's it's like very caramely. Oh yeah. Um, I agree with you there. I don't know if I I don't know if I if I would recognize it. As a box, I reckon I drink it. I reckon that's right away as a box. It's a lot of the multi is, sweet characters. It is really very sweet, kind of sticky, but in a good way. Um, it's sticky, but in a good way. <laughs> Some people just like it sticky. It's in a good way. It's a personal preference. What do you think, there, Steel? Um, I'm not sure what to think. <laughs> <laughs> Because, you know, I'm not a big fan of the smell. No? No, me no. either. Yeah, that's how it's... And, you know, when I went to take my first drink, I did the mistake of breathing in through my nose. Uh. So that's why I made that face like, <laughs> yeah. I didn't see yeah. that. I was over here. Oh, you'll see it on the video. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. That guy knows what I'm talking about. That guy right yeah. there. Fuck that guy. So that's not very nice. That's not. Usually usually I'm the one who goes like that. Gosh, Kevin, gosh. Alright, well, you know, it's it I think it's I think it's pretty good. I'm gonna give it a uh, a five and a half. I'm gonna give oh, it no, a five it's, and a half. I think it's, it's good if you know I don't smell it. Oh, uh, it's the it's the smell that's turning you off? Yeah. I think I I think the smell is pleasant, but that's just me. Um I think it's good for a five and a half. It's really cheap and it tastes if I get in the if I feel the need to eat candy and also drink a beer for some reason, this would fit the bill perfectly. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna give it a six. I think it's above average for what it is and for the price. You don't see very many companies making a two ninety nine six pack for Bach, like for a Bach no. style. You see Pilsners. No. Yeah, you see a lot of Pilsners. really cheap you see a lot of really cheap to produce beer. But you know, it, it's it's you know it's above average for what it is. Um, you know, it, it's you can't compare it to some of the higher end box, but mm -mm. also the higher end box. You know, some of those are four dollars for one. Yeah, you're gonna and you're gonna get you can get twelve of these for that price. You know what I mean? It's a classic example of you get what you pay for. Yeah, and, and I'm really glad you guys paid for it. Just saying, thank you. Still, I actually think you paid for this one. I did. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and give this a six. It's good for what it is. The price is great, you know. And as long as I don't smell it while I'm drinking it, I enjoy it. You know, it's just that smell, not a big fan of it. I will get you a clothespin if we ever get this again. It's still not as bad as the puke pecan beer. 
Uh, we'll redo that on the show. Don't 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 speak of the Shiner the Shiner birthday beer. No, it was the, no, not the birthday. That was oh, the, that was that the was holiday, celebration. Holiday cheer. Yeah. Not holiday cheer. All right. Well, that's our episode. If there's something you like, see on our channel. You can leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm Special K. I'm Still Reserved. And I'm Radar. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.